This is the 2017 Las Vegas Sun High School Football Media Day at South Point, brought to you by Metro Diner, where the locals eat. Here we got the Desert Pines Jaguars, senior receivers DeAndre Newsom and Jaden Mitchell, and senior defensive lineman Lorenzo Brown. Last year, you guys finally get that championship that this school's been trying to get for so long. How do you stay hungry in the offseason, DeAndre? Um, we just got to keep... We just got to keep our momentum up, knowing that we lost 30 seniors last year and we kind of had to regroup. We just want to keep that momentum going throughout the summer and keep it pushing so it's not like we lost it. Jaden, you guys got a receiver. You, you come into this school, you see a receiver leaves that goes to USC, a receiver that's going to Arizona. Kind of, How excited are you to get into this school and, and try to make your mark? Um, I'm very excited, actually. Just, just being put in the situation I'm in right now, being where I have those role models that come before me and I was really good friends with them before they left. So they really just paved the way and made it so I can do what I can do and get my name out there even more. And Lorenzo, what, how does this off season feel different from maybe the last two? Maybe you guys finally got that championship so a little bit of pressure off your shoulders? I mean, nothing, doesn't nothing really change. You know, it's always been business as usual. You know, um, a lot of people, like, I, um, we lost a lot of linemen. We lost a lot of a lot, a lot of key players and things like that. But you know, Desert Pines. You know, it, there, there's always going to be talent at Desert Pines. You know, we have a lot of young talent, a bunch of young bodies. You know, but we just continue to work hard, work hard in the weight room, on and off the field. Make sure our grades are cool. You know, we just you got to work hard, and and we and when it's time to put in the work, that's when we put in the work. Because a, a lot of people are like basically sleep on us and saying that we can't do it, but. I know that we, we work hard every day and we put in the work, even though we're low on bodies, but we still feel like that we, we can win it again because we got the same mentality and we're not gonna go and go into the season like, oh, we're all this and all that bad. We're gonna go in the same mentality like we lost state instead of we won it. But we just wanna go into the season with the same mindset as we came in last season, and that's the win. This team lost a lot of leaders graduation, Tony Fields, Mark Hill Grace, and guys like that. Have you have you felt like you need to step up and have you kind of filled that role as a senior on defense? Yes, um, I, I feel that word a lot. I feel that role a lot because you know there's there, there's a ton of young guys that that's pines that need leadership and you know there's any any team can be great and win a lot of games but in order to be the best team and to win a great team you have to have discipline. And I feel like we're getting to the point where we're getting very disciplined and we know our roles. And when it's time to be a leader, it's time to be a leader. And it's, when it's time to be serious, we know when to get serious. And I'm pretty sure, like, everybody knows that, that, gotta step up. that we got to step up and we got to do what we got to do. And DeAndre, same thing on offense. You guys got a lot of fresh faces. But a lot of these guys have played roles in the, in the state championship last year. Kind of how excited are you to see what you guys can do on offense this year? It's it's kind of nerve wracking just to see that we lost almost everyone, but I know we, I know our seniors have to step up and kind of, because we we were there last year, we know what we know how it goes, so we kind of have to step up and and teach and, and guide the young ones up with us. And from from what I seen, that was working pretty well. It was going pretty good, so we should be alright. After Grayson went down and Grimes stepped in at quarterback, and it was kind of an issue the whole year. You didn't know. Because I mean, the first game of the year when he got hurt, how nice is it with a little bit more certainty going in with the quarterback positions for both your receivers this year to kind of get that uh, mesh with him in the off season? It's another relief. It's another relief knowing that we're we're still build, we're building our bond and it's gonna continue. We can kind of like we're just getting our chemistry. chemistry. And same thing, Jaden. Yeah, just how, how nice has that been knowing who the quarterback is going to be and being able to work out with him all season? It's great, honestly, just building up our chemistry because we do have a lot of new faces on our offense and defense. So just being able to build that up and being able to get comfortable and be uh, perfect our timing is it's just really a big relief because now we know that we don't have to worry about, hey, who's second string? We already know who's our first string quarterback and we already know how we can build that up. All right, well, there you have it. The Jaguars are reloaded and ready for another run at the state title. That's it from South Point for our Las Vegas Sun High School Football Media Day.